Hi, my name is Matt. I work as a customer support engineer here at StrongDM. And uh, today I will show you how to use um, GCP uh, secrets uh, to access your resources through, as, uh, through StrongDM. Um, so the use case here is I have a, a Google Cloud uh, MySQL setup. It has a username and password to, as credentials. But instead of um, normally when, with StrongDM by default, we would store that username and password in StrongDM. Uh, but you might have a different workflow where you store your secrets um, directly in Google uh, Cloud Platform instead of with StrongDM. So what we'll do is we'll give access to StrongDM um, to your secrets. And whenever a user acts, tries to access through us um, um, and has access through us uh, to the MySQL, will go and pick up um, the secrets from Google. So the first thing that we're gonna need to do is um, create a service account that will uh, give permission to the gateway to, um, to access the secrets. So the role that we need here is the minimal role, secret manager, secret accessor. And oops. We pick that. Once that's done, we can go in that in that um, uh, service account, and th there there we can, we're going to create a key. It um, it's a little different than AWS, where AWS will give you a key and a secret key pair. Here, uh, GCP uh, gives you a JSON file to download. So you, you create that and download it to your workstation. Then you would need to SCP it to the gateway. I've already done that. Um, and I've put that file in, in, in my home uh, directory on the gateway. So to configure the gateway uh, in order that it picks up that file, we'll need to access uh, this file, etc sysconfig sdm proxy, and add a um, add the file to it. So the, there's already going to be a sdm relay token in it. That that was when the gateway was created. When you started the gateway at, at gateway creation, you passed it the token. We're going to add Google application credentials, and we're going to point uh, the path of the file that we just downloaded. Once that's done, all we need to uh, do is figure out which project we're working with. In this case here, I'm working with the strongdm-sandbox sandbox project. So with this done, oh, I'm sorry. We need to restart, um, restart the gateway once that's done already done it so it's not so once that's done we go on the admin ui here and we go under secret store add secret store i'm going to call it gcp secret store we select the type gcp secret manager and here is the project id um, that we found that we're using basically uh, here. So that that ID, not the name, that the ID here. So strong DM dash sandbox. Goes green right away. That means that the gateway is able to access that secret store. Now, after that, we're we're gonna create we, we've already created two um, uh, secrets. One is called username, well, mdubay MySQL username. The other one is called mdubay MySQL password. We're going to use it to add it to add our data source. So it's a MySQL database. Uh, I'm going to go in the Google platform to get the IP. 
the database. I didn't create any special database, so I'll use the MySQL default. Here's the change. Instead of using strong DM to store the credentials, we will use the secret store. Once we added a secret store, that becomes an option here. Um, the path to the credential in the case of um, GCP is going to be the last part of, of this here. So you can, you can remove everything, um, everything before, after secret, before secrets, because by giving it the project, we'll add the project, the project ID and slash secrets. So anything after is what you want. So here I'll take that name. Now for the password, same thing here, everything after secrets. I mean, you could put other slashes, it's up to you, but that's where you would start. Now we can create that. I'm gonna do a check now. Here we can see that this gateway, which has the, uh, the GCP token is able to reach that database. We reload and it's accessible. Now you can, you can share it. Uh, with your, your users using roles. And uh, that's it uh, for, for uh, setting up GCP Secret Store. If you have any questions about uh, this presentation, you can post them in the comments. And if you like to hear about other how-tos and tips and tricks about using um, StrongDM, uh, you can like and subscribe uh, our uh, channel. Thank you. 